In this video, I am going to use a scientific calculator to help you figure the angle of a stairway. I've already got a couple different videos I've made, but in this one we are going to use the Calculator X8. And I got this uh, on a Windows 10 app, and there are plenty of calculators all over the internet you can use to um, do this. Um, so for those of you who just want the nuts and bolts of it, let's go ahead and get started. We are going to need to switch the tangent to a negative tangent. And you can usually do that by clicking a shift or a second key in the upper left hand corner. So we need this right here. Let's go ahead and take the rise of the stairway seven inches and divide it by the width or length of the stairway. Um, step 10 inches and then push the equal sign we end up with 0.7 all we have to do is pop this number and this is the angle of our stairway basically 35 degrees 34.99 that's close enough to 35 degrees now what if we have a 7 0.5 seven and a half inch riser and an 11 inch tread we now have 0.681 pop the button here we have a 34.28 degree angle so again simple this isn't that difficult especially once you figure out how to get to here and again you just get to there by pushing the button to switch it over now here's a mistake that I have made myself you might end up making it and that of course would be if you divide the tread into the riser height you're going to get a different number and then that's going to be the opposite angle in the triangle so you're going to have the angle you're looking for a 90 degree angle and then this of course would be the other angle of the stairway so it's not always going to work so if you start cutting materials and you see that they're not working they're off quite a bit make sure that you didn't reverse these numbers Again, it's simple. Clear it, put the riser in first, divide it by the tread. We get a number and then we just hit the tangent. And then, of course, we have our degrees here. So this would be the um, opposite number that uh, we would be using.